If I can get up. So, like I was saying, this stuff always works sometimes. Look at that. Perfect. Man, I'll tell you, that was great. All right. So, our little tool worked. Yes, electricians have a thing called the snake. It does the same thing. I actually have one. Right up there in the job box. Just thought of that. But it's on a big wheel. Would have been a pain in the ass. That's the thing. That was just smaller and it worked better. You know, I could have used the snake and kind of tried to hook it with the snake and pulled it down. But the snake's on like a big wheel and you got to kind of crank the damn thing in. And it, that just would have been a pain in the ass. So yeah, anybody watching this says, oh, why didn't you just use a snake? That worked out great. Once I got in there, really only took about two seconds. I was able to put it under, turn it a little bit, pull, and it hooked, and there you go, man. I was like a trophy angler right there. So now my trophy is to get to hook the light up, and I got to crawl back out of the damn boat again. Although maybe I could do it from up in the front I think I could probably reach from up there and not have to get out. Yeah. Uh, one thing I do have, though, is a little knot, I see. Uh, of course. Right. Why wouldn't there be a knot in the damn wire after I just spent all that time? Why wouldn't there be a knot in there? Well, there we go. Let's just pull that through. Okay. So the knot's through. So let's... Let's pull some more of this wire through. There we go. There we are. Well, I guess I did make sure I had enough wire. Hmm. That's for sure. I always make sure I have enough wire. Okay. So, let's gonna straighten this out a little bit. Let's see if we can feed you through in there. Get you in there nice, yeah. There we go. Tuck you guys in there. Get you in there, yeah, beautiful. Let's hang you up right there. We just ran a clothesline down through it so we can hang it up. All right, bad joke. Bad joke. Okay, so there's the old screw holes right there. Not too bad, not too shabby. Okay, I gotta put you down again for a second. Alright guys, there you go. It's in. And here's where the wire comes up. And we're going to get it to come through underneath. And bring it right out and up. Awesome. Pretty cool. Alright, well, that's what we got so far. So, i got to organize some things, put it away. And uh, probably drill a little hole and pop that through. So I guess let's get it figured out. All right, guys. So we are underneath the console, and there's a little wire that we put out. So we'll get that. We'll put a little clip over here to kind of hold it, so it stays over there. We get a little clip to screw in. That'll stay up. We get it wrapped up in here. Come down here and it's just hanging out. So now it's going to go in and it's going to go to one of these switches in here. Um, I don't know if I'm going to do that just yet. And also going to look to see. I don't know if this is a speaker. That's not hooked to anything. i got to find out where those go to. There's the horn. Horn's garbage. I'm going to get a new horn. So that's not too bad. I could do that. Get a horn. Everything else looks pretty good. 
looks all right. Courtesy light doesn't work. I should probably check that. Although I do have other courtesy lights, or I could order some new ones. Okay. That's the steering. There, we'll get a cup holder. Here we get some maybe some LED lit ones that'll look nice in there. Uh, but for the most part, under here it doesn't look too bad. It looks pretty good. I don't even know if that speaker works. I could probably check the speaker over here and see if the radio turns on. See so, you know, we have power. I think that's really the only speaker on the boat, to tell you the truth. I think that's it. Okay, so the call under here. Oh no, there's another speaker over there. Right there. That comes out of the wire. Right there on the radio. Man, I don't even know if they work. It'd be awesome if they did. <laughs> this is all garbage. You gotta come out. There's a screw for it. Yeah, I gotta order a new one of those. Okay. So let's see. I think this thing is gonna get to the truth. Man, I don't even know. Probably not, huh? Probably not. You know what though? Let's just give it a check. Oh, the power is on. Okay. Never shut the power off. Let's see. Nothing. Yeah, the radio's garbage. I figured it would be. You still got nothing? Still nothing. I wrapped on it a little bit. Kind of hoping that, you know, it would free it up or even just clicking it and kind of break it free, but that doesn't seem to be happening. So, alright, so we got that light in, we got the switch in, batteries charged, now we need to deal with the starter. Trim works up and down, not a problem, so that works. Radio's garbage, we knew that when we started. Kind of figured it was, not a big deal. I do have another uh, marine radio in the garage uh, that came out of the old pontoon boat. Um, or I could just get another cheap marine radio like that. That's a CD player and stuff. Nobody uses CDs and stuff anymore anyway so you know, a nice Bluetooth radio to go in there uh, would be pretty awesome uh, pretty key but I don't think unless I could find one that size I'm not gonna I could do a delete kit and put switches there that could work too could run power all the way over and put switches there and put a radio down on the bottom over here like one of the round ones like we put on the pontoon boat or even right in here yeah there's plenty of room for it there there's nothing there you could drill a hole and mount it right there and then just put a plate here uh, with switches so that we can kind of get some of them off over there because there's not really a lot of room over there for switches um, so yeah, that's kind of like what I'm thinking. That might be a way better option, I'm thinking. Yeah. I am mean, thinking that that could be a way better option if I put some uh, a plate over there and got some switches over there for lights and different things like that. It's kind of out of the driver's cockpit, but it's over here. Um... I don't know, I guess I'm going to have to toss that one around. 
I don't think that's a bad idea, to tell you the truth. But, all right, well, hey, thanks for following along today. I know maybe today wasn't too productive, but uh, just all the little things that you got to do when you're working on a boat, you know, some of them take a lot of time. They're not all that interesting, and there's not a lot of videos on it, but I don't know. Kind of felt like making a realer video, you know, than what you kind of see out there a lot of. Um, you know, all these stupid little things that you kind of run into while you're doing stuff. Things don't always go easy or how they always want to make it look like they go. Uh, oh, yeah, not a big deal. It took five minutes. When, you know, it probably took an hour or two, but uh, that's just what it is. So, hey, thanks for following along today. I appreciate it. Keep, keep it on giving me some company and uh, follow along the videos. Please hit that like button. Uh, share. Uh, do me a favor, too. Uh, put a comment in the video, um, you know, down below. Uh, let me know what you think. Uh, if I'm doing something right, if you have any ideas, uh, if you've gone through some of this stuff before, and, um, you know, you got any pointers or tips or anything like that. Or if you just kind of see something and you're like, hey, by the way, uh, you know, you forgot this or you forgot that or just great job, pretty cool, appreciate it, anything like that. You know, a little bit of communication back and forth would be pretty cool and um, help grow the channel. So, again, thanks for following along. And uh, please like, share, subscribe. You guys have a great day. Go out, find yourself something to do, get a little project, a little hobby, a little something. Sometimes they really stink and, um, you know, you have your bad days, but. Most of the time it's pretty fulfilling just to kind of be out there doing something and, uh, you know, it, it is what it is. It's fun. I like it. It's fun. Um, it's enjoyable. So, again, thanks for watching. Like, share, subscribe, and hey, man, we'll catch you on the next one.